Bucket, how to take perfect photos for Instagram and Facebook. But before we get started, make sure you show us some love by subscribing, hitting the notification bell, and clicking the thumbs up button if you liked this video. Ready? Here we go. Light. With photography, lighting is everything. Here's a lighting tip to take your pictures from blah to beautiful. Check it out. If you've got a flashlight on your phone, use it as a spotlight and shine it on your subject. Then snap a few shots with your camera. The before and after is pretty remarkable, and all it took was a little bit of extra light. Play with angles. This technique can be a lot of fun. Show off your yummy dessert by snapping pics at different angles. You can show the side view or the angle from above. You can really get creative with different angles. Macro magnifier effect. If you want to get every little detail in your picture, try using the macro effect. Place a macro lens in front of your camera lens and really bring out all the delicious details hiding in your subject. Adjust the distance and angle until the shot is in focus. Then take those gorgeous pictures and watch everything come to life. Elements Play with different elements in your photos to make them stand out from the rest. If you've made a dish look aesthetically pleasing, it makes for a much more interesting picture. Sprinkle some extra elements around your dish, like coconut flakes and coffee beans. This gives the picture added depth and dimension. Doesn't this look yummy? Through glasses Add different colored glasses to create a shaded effect for your pictures. It's like creating your very own Instagram filter. Pretty cool, right? Color glare. You can create a prism look on your photos by holding up a DVD or CD next to your camera lens. Angle it until you see the prism hit the right spot on your photo. It looks like your food is at the end of a rainbow. Marshmallow Effect You can use colorful cotton to create a pretty awesome effect for your pics. Just stretch it out in front of your lens and snap the shot. It gives the picture a soft lens look with a slightly colorful hue. Don't neglect the background. We've all taken pictures of something without paying attention to what's in the background. It happens. But your pictures can be so much better if you step up your background game. Before you take your picture, do a little set dressing. Add different colors and textures to make your pictures really pop. See the difference? Reflection. Using reflections can definitely take your Instagram pics to the next level. Set your subject on a piece of foil and add some shimmery paper behind it. Use a flashlight to pick up the flecks of light from the glitter paper. Your food never looks so glamorous. Through glass. Taking pictures through a piece of glass makes for unique and interesting effects. First, spray a piece of glass with drops of water. Then take your picture through the glass. Pretty eye-catching, isn't it? Bokeh. You know that cool look where the background is out of focus? Here's how to get that look. First, crinkle up some aluminum foil. Spread it out and place it behind your subject.
Use the fast lens at the widest aperture to get the right effect. And that's all there is to it. Shoot in process. Here's a fun way to do a sort of stop motion effect with your photos. Take pictures of each part of the process, then put them together. This set of photos tells a story. See how it works? Space. Make sure you are making the best use of space in your pictures. Arrange the subjects around and tell you are happy with the amount of negative space in the back. You want just the right amount of space in your photos. Too much space makes the items look unremarkable. Sprinkling elements like berries can help to fill the space in the background. Sev. Taking your pictures through a sieve makes an awesome photo filter. Just shine a flashlight through the strainer. It makes this cool lighting effect. Play with the light and shadows for the perfect look. It will take your picture from boring to dramatic. Thanks for watching Crafty Hackers. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more crafty hacks and ideas. See you later.